In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a turkey and turn it into a Thanksgiving place card. First, fold your paper in half. And the corners up. And then fold it the other way. Then make sure the fold right here where there's no opening is at the top. Then we're going to draw something like it. So it's like question mark, but we're going to start here. Don't really go in as much. Well, go in and then stay in. So like that. Looks like question mark, just no doubt right there. <laughs> then, curve this, like that. Then, continue it and draw an eye. Then, we're going to draw a circle in the eye and color the rest in. So, it looks like that. Then, we're going to flat our hand. Then, we're going to do the thingy. Facing down and then under its eye, put like that. And, and then we're going to get this and do the body. So draw, draw and stop right there. Wait, stop right there. Then do, well, yeah, we're missing something. Get, right, start there. Go like that, curve, like that. Then we're going to draw curves on it. About three, like that. And then, we're going to draw the other part of the snack. Start right here and draw the part of his neck. Like that. Then draw a line down like that. Then, if it helps, you can kind of turn it like wait, that and then draw. Wait, first, actually, we're going to draw a ruffle kind of thing right here right here like facing up and then draw a line to connect it right there then let's draw another line the same height like that. And then let's draw some lines that are taller, like taller than those ones. I learned how to draw this turkey from Art for Kids Hub. Then we're con going to connect the lines with bump. Then once it gets to taller lines, make a separate part, then do these. And then once we got that done, 
Let's draw a short line like that, and then do a longer line, then a longer line. And when you do this, fan, kind of fan it out. Then once you get about there, we're going to make the lines shorter again. So do it lower. And then we're going to connect them with these bumps. Then, once you got that done, we're going to draw a curve right there, then do another one on each one of these feathers. Then, you're going to do the line that top, but you're not going to do two like we done that one, because the top of the feathers is um the other part of the line the curve so do that to all the feathers once you get that done then we'll draw the feet so what you do is you draw two lines and then draw a kind of a v if you turn it that way you can see the v and then do that right here too. There, we're done with the turkey. Now let's color. Then the colors you're going to need are brown, orange or red. I didn't have a red in here, so I used orange. So brown, orange or red, um, a light brown, a yellow and a white. What you can do with your white, you can just, because usually white has a lot of colors on it, because usually you put on just a lot of colors, so you can just get all the colors out. So your white will mark there. Okay, I have my white ready. So then, what you're going to do is you're going to grab your orange or red, color the neck and the head, but don't color that or the beak or right there. And if you have orange, Kind of press a little harder to make it look r like red. But I had orange on this one. But it still looks pretty good. Okay. Then, now that we got that done, grab our yellow and mix it in with the orange. Oh, I got it out, it's fine. There, once we got the head, the neck and head done, we're going to grab our, oh wait, for God's sake, you also need a gray. Um, You're going to grab your gray, color, the things that we didn't color, so right here, this thing, and then that, and then the beak. There, like that. And then we're going to grab our brown, our dark brown, color the 
buddy. But don't color these feathers. Then we're going to, I mix some orange in here and it looks pretty good. So. And I'm going to get my brown again and color. Now that we have that, we're going to get our white, and we're just going to color right here in center. Then we can put a little over here. Over here. There. Then we're going to get our, wait, let me look, our brown color. Kind of do it a little lighter, wait, light brown. I forgot to have that, light brown. Then, we're going to make some dark brown, too. Then, get our yellow, make some yellow in there, too. Then, I'm going to get my dark brown. Then let's get our light brown and color. See where we drew those things? We're going color. We're not going color that. Up. We're going to leave it white, but we're not going color up here. Just the bottom part. The thing about oil pastels is that you can keep adding colors until you like it. kind of hard to get down here. There. And then we're going to grab, where is it, where is it? Here it is. Our dark brown in color up here, all dark. Make sure to leave that top part white too. Once you finish those feathers, we're going to get our yellow and color the feet yellow. We finished! Now, to make a place card, we put somebody's name on it so they know where to sit. I'll put my brother Cole. And stand up. And if it doesn't stand up as well, you can, like if it kind of falls over, you can 
fold this part a little and then unfold it then good that part would go and it would help it stand up better so we got it